Oh yeah. Okay, we started the video. We're gonna go on our first what adventure vlog? today. Yeah, it's the vlog, the first day of the vlog. Day I'm one. very excited, day one. Our mom is cleaning up the garage, so we're very distracted. I'm Brendan, by the way. Yeah, Brianna. I'm Brianna. We're gonna go to the lighthouse today, maybe fly some kites if we have some wind. We don't really know what the wind is gonna be like. And then we're gonna drive around an island to see where we're gonna kayak the next day it's not raining. So, Brendan. All right, we'll see you at the lighthouse. Shall we? See you at the lighthouse. We're living in a golden age, don't hold back on what you're giving, push your back into your living, don't hold back. We got to location number one. We're at the Point Judith Lighthouse. You can just barely see it over there. It's, it's extremely foggy. foggy. Really don't know why. Brennan is getting the drone ready. We were gonna fly kites because this is our absolute favorite, favorite place to fly kites. But uh, it's not very windy. Which is good for the drone. So we don't really know how that's gonna go. But like Brennan said, it's good for the drone because then the drone's not gonna fly all around and get sucked up by the wind. But. We shall see. We'll also try and walk over closer to the lighthouse. Because right now you really can't even see it. A foggy day in London town I had me low I had me down I viewed the morning With such alarm The British Museum Had lost its charm How long, I wondered Could this thing last But the age of miracles I hadn't passed for suddenly I saw you there and through foggy London town Time to try the kites. Well, only Delta Charlie. Delta Brennan, Charlie. tell us why we're trying Delta Charlie. Uh, it's the best one, the other one sucks. <laughs> yeah, it's kind of true. Oh, the other one is terrible. It's my original, the OG. You need at least it's the best, one. it's broken, it's missing a pole. But if you get it, I like to pretend it's a trick kite because it's kind of how you do it. But this is Delta Charlie, and we don't know why it's named Delta Charlie, and we've just embraced it and we kind of love it. I don't, I don't know they know. It's a penguin, which I don't even know. No one has any idea what it means. I didn't know they named kites, but. I didn't either, but this is the Delta Charlie kite. So, yeah, let's see if we can fly it. Good shots, and you don't even you forget it. And I think an issue forward. that we've come up with is that Brendan is going to be is significantly taller than me, six feet, and I'm five three on a good day. So if we're standing up, it's going to be impossible for us both to talk in the camera and see both of our heads. It's true, don't you think? Uh huh. Yeah, it's just. Uh, Here, guys, you can fly the kite. Yeah. He's almost gone. You can barely see him through the fog. Oh, Delta Charles. Not what? All right. Brianna's uh, brought Delta Charlie down. Also, we discovered because we were talking and we were wondering if Delta Charlie had any friends. <laughs> and apparently, Delta Charlie has a lot of friends. Yeah, you can check out uh, Delta Charlie Kites, HQ Kites. Check out HQ Kites. They have a lot, a lot of fun kites. We got, obviously, the famous Delta Charlie, but they have tons more. Yeah. Not sponsored, but big fan of, H of HQ yeah, Kites. Yeah, we, we do love their kites. If you, want, if you would like to sponsor us. It's literally not even windy today, and it worked perfectly. So, uh, yeah, HQ Kites. All right, let's uh, head to the lighthouse. Okay, we're walking over to the lighthouse. We're not going to be able to get that close because everything is closed because of our great, lovely friend, coronavirus. I'm not sure if it's because of that or because the parking lot's closed. The parking lot's also closed, so we just had to park over here. Because I'm not the closer on the block. 
Also, that's it is too. very foggy, so fog won't be good. But we're getting closer. You can kind of see it. We're gonna try to hit almost every uh, every drivable lighthouse in Rhode Island. Yeah, a lot of them are on islands, as, as you would imagine. Yes, yeah, so maybe we'll go kayaking to get near some of them. But I was Googling this morning and one of them's 10 miles of a kayak. I don't really think our kayaking skills are, are that good. But maybe we can get there somewhere. Yeah. Let's see how much better now. Oh yeah. Much better. But usually, I mean, you can walk right up to it and go on the other side and see what they have. A little Tina. That's it, Lighthouse 1, Point Judith. Boom. Lighthouse. To Great Island. All right, we're crossing the bridge into Great Island. We just uh, went through yeah, Gallery. Great Island, here's the sign. Wow, this is great. <laughs> you know what else is, Brianna? What? An island. This is true, it's great and it's an island, so it's kind of a win-win. Creative name. All right, we're here at Great Island, but so far we've just seen a bunch of residential neighborhoods, but we're looking, possibly down this road, right? Be able to find a good place to kayak. I also wonder if like on the other side of Galilee there's like a launch and then we could kayak over yeah. right here. Yeah. It's kind of what I'm thinking. So this is really it though, it's just Literally a road. It's residential. Out this side though is the ocean. And then out there, you got Galilee, the port of Galilee. We used to get our lobsters there. Ooh, what about right Maybe here? Maybe right here. No, it's not really like, I mean, we. There's like really no way to get down. People doing some uh, some clam looks. Hi, we're home. We uh we checked out Great <laughs> I Island. We're doing it. All right. Just looking at my email. Uh, sorry. All right, we're home. We uh we checked out Great Island. Wasn't much there, but just we're, we're gonna try to we're gonna try to kayak uh, there. Yeah, at some point. we'll ask Brad and he'll tell us where he kayaked and we'll probably just go there. Then we uh checked yeah. out the lighthouse and we flew the drone and flew the kite. And okay. now we're back. And that's it. Literally, it was a it was a chill day because we got a late start. It's uh, Adventure Day One. Yeah. Uh, you should see this on July first, and then maybe daily. We're gonna do daily adventures. But today it's but the twenty third of June. We're doing daily adventures, day. but not always, you know, daily videos. But yeah. See you uh, tomorrow. tomorrow. <laughs>